I would say to someone who's donating for the first time, thank you. Thank you for saving my life because it's a life-saving event. And you may not ever get to see the person who you're giving this blood to, but they will thank you for the rest of their lives. If it weren't for blood donations, I wouldn't be here today. If it weren't for blood donations, I wouldn't be here. If it weren't for blood donations, I may not be here. If it weren't for blood donations, I may not be alive today. You know, many in our community, and, and certainly any place in the world, that uh, uh, would not have life if uh, this were not something that people were doing. Um, in November of 2007, I was diagnosed with ALL leukemia, which is a blood cancer. To start my treatment, I had to have over 15 bags of blood, plus platelets, and throughout my treatment, when I got chemo, um, it sent my levels down, so I'd have to keep repeating through blood transfusions. I think typically people tend to just think of the accidents and those type of things, but if they thought about the, the cancer patients that need blood donations, surgeries that need blood donations, transplant surgeries, the blood banks require a tremendous amount of blood to be able to have it on hand. In the tri-state area, there are 31 hospitals that we supply. We need 100,000 units of red cells every year in the tri-state. Our donation record is approximately 96 and a half, 97,000 units in a year. If it weren't for blood donations, there would be a lot of people who would be losing their lives. As a trauma surgeon, I'm constantly doing big operations on patients in the middle of the night for which I need blood. Uh, and without the Hawksworth Center, I, I, I don't even know what my, my care, my practice would be uh, without their help. And if I didn't have it, patients would die. It's that simple. Donating blood can literally save lives. And that's probably about the only way some of us are ever going to be able to save a life. It's significant contribution. Something to be proud of. It's important to donate because it's, it's mankind. It's, it's, it's our nature to want to help and to want to be good, uh, genuine, generous people. And anything we can do to help one another should be done. And Donating blood is probably one of the finest things that someone can do to actually save someone else's life, and one of the easiest to have. Actually, blood donors are healthier and live longer. It's a great way to increase your antioxidants. You don't need to take vitamin E. Being a blood donor is a healthy procedure. And besides, you get a great snack at the end with some juice, so in the end it all works out. I need 50 people every year to donate blood so that I can live. A couple of pints or two is not going to hurt a person, you know, but that pint or two could save a life for a person who's in dire need of blood. Well, there is no alternative to blood donations, and uh, frankly, uh, until we have uh, an artificial bone marrow developed, which may happen in the next 20 to 50 years, uh, we're going to require blood donations from donors, healthy, living donors. It is important for us to give of ourselves in such a way so that others may have life. And uh, this is one of those great ways to be able to do that. Seeing what Hawksworth does on a daily basis with our patients, it, it's pretty inspirational and vitally important for, for patients to live and make it through each and every day it will make a difference and I love to point that out to people who don't take much attention to it. Uh, blood drives are essential to support the needs of the community. It is the community's responsibility to provide blood for its needs. We at Hawksworth are stewards of the blood supply for the community, so it's our privilege to look after the blood stores. However, there is no substitute 
for blood donations, we have to get this from members of the community. And that includes businesses, uh, high schools, church groups, and just the regular volunteer blood donor. What made me start uh, donating blood was part of a drive, actually. It was when I was in high school, I was 18, and we were very much into giving back to others. And this blood drive at school was one way that we could give back to uh, members in our community. Hawksworth has a number of different ways that it collects blood for the community. Uh, and corporate blood drives are among the most important. Uh, well, we approached Hawksworth a couple of years ago with the idea of a blood drive. Uh, this is Cincinnati, Ohio. Uh, it's Chile Town, USA. So literally and figuratively, uh, Chile is in our blood here. I think with having the blood drives here at Toyota, it's an easy way for people to get involved in donating blood. The drives here at the office allow people the opportunity to perhaps donate for the first time or to take time that they wouldn't ordinarily if they had to get in their car and travel. Another connection between Hawksworth and Gold Star was the fact that uh, we have our Chili Mobile, which is a mobile event marketing uh, unit, and they had their Blood Mobile, so we felt that we could take our Chili Mobile to all of the Hawksworth collection sites, and in turn, they could bring their Blood Mobile to uh, Gold Star Chili locations, and instead of offering cookies and juice, we could offer cheese conies, uh, again, part of the Cincinnati tie. It's a way to bring people together. Uh, you get people uh, to come through uh, the van and, and give blood and while you're in there the, the Hawksworth staff do a great job of making it uh, comfortable and um, kind of a, a fun environment and so you get to meet new people too so it's, it's a way to, to come together and, and to give back to your community and help support the people in your community. It gets so many people to donate blood because if you see one person doing it then it kind of is like a trailing effect. So when people sign up and they know that Tom, Dick and Harry is also there, so it makes it easier for them to commit to donating blood. The sense of community within the office I think is that much stronger, especially when you're sitting next to your manager or laying next to your manager on a bench. Obviously you get a lot closer, you become a lot more friendly with each other. Uh, it's not just a work atmosphere anymore, it's a, it's a friendly atmosphere. And having that common bond to tie, in, tie into is, is something tremendous. And it's a great sense of camaraderie to walk down the hallway and see someone who's wearing that sticker that says, I donated blood today. It's just, it reinforces that we like to do things for the community. People feel good in the workplace when they know they're able to do something for other people. Once corporations begin to participate in blood drives, they become a part of something that employees almost expect to do and want to do because of the opportunity to do something unique in helping the community. It's fantastic to see UC Health employees giving back uh, to Hawksworth, and it's a, a vital need to the community as well. Certainly a company the size of Toyota, we have our share of team members here that have family members that have been recipients of blood from the Hawksworth Blood Center. So this is something that not only do we do uh, to benefit the community at large, we're benefiting it's the people that we work with and possibly even our, our own families down the line. I would tell any company that is thinking about doing a blood drive to give it a try. Uh, it's a great community partner to partner with Hawksworth. Uh, giving blood is you're donating it and you don't know where it's going to go and who's going to receive that. Uh, all we know about donations are that the blood is given to Hawksworth and from there it's distributed to wherever it's needed. And uh, so it is, it's something about sharing and it, it's a personal sharing. It's more than putting a dollar in a plate. When we have held blood drives at Taft, uh, we've had a wonderful uh, outpouring of support both from the lawyers and from the staff who have been able to participate. It takes really not a lot of time out of the workday, and uh, once people have participated in it, they are always coming back. Uh, we find that the Hawksworth people make it very easy, the setup, the takedown, and also the follow-up. When I get that letter, um, it's really a neat feeling. Um, it kind of brings a smile to my face because you open it up and you get to, to read and you understand that what you did actually helped save somebody else. And it, it just kind of brings it full circle that what I did a month ago or two months ago really was put to use and 
somebody gained from that. They get to, get to live another day. They get to see their kids, they get to see their father, they get to see their mother. Uh, they get to live a satisfying life. And to me, that's just, that, that gratification is more than anything could ever do. Obviously, the donation is made knowing that someone's going to receive it. And when you confirm that, it is a good feeling that you've made a difference. Giving blood is, is about saving lives. And Hawksworth is an organization that brings people together to help save lives. And to me, that is tremendous. So we've got to have blood drives. We've got to give back to one another. And we need to keep donating blood. Blood donors save my life. Who will you save?